Good morning, everybody. It's Maria here. Okay, today's project is a card. Um, I made this minion card before, and this is my most pinned on Pinterest, I think. And I made this a long time ago, and um, it's very cute. My daughter and my brother loves the minions, so I made this card before, and this is my um, my prototype. But we're not making a minion with the blue um, outfit. We are making a French-made minion today because um, the Blooms and Butterflies color challenge number 22 requires Daffodil Delight Black um, basic gray and basic gray which is this one and smoky slate which is that one and so I was like thinking of what card I should be making for the blooms and butterfly color challenge number 22 and with all these colors in mind I thought why don't I make a French minion card so if you're interested to see how I made this card then please keep watching materials that we will need will be, of course, our adhesive. You need a tape runner or a glue, and you need your mini glue dots. So that's the first thing. You will need your Daffodil Delight or any yellow cardstock that you have. I'm making all Stampin' Up! products, so this is Daffodil Delight. And this is just a typical A2 card, but in order to get that rounded edge, you will need a round plate. I basically just use this round plate to trace the rounded edge to give me that round edge over here. So, and of course, for the outfit, you will need a four and a quarter by two inches. Yeah, this is four and a quarter by two inches black cardstock, and that will create the skirt. You will need your basic white cardstock to create the scallop edges here, and I basically use this edgelets. Um, adorning accents and I use the scallop edge right there. So I just cut a couple strips of the Whisper White cardstock and cut, um, use my scallop thing here so that I can be using it for the skirt and the pocket right here. If you don't have this adorning accents then you will need either a scallop punch or a doily. So anyway, black cardstock, four and a quarter, the width of the card in two inches and then for the pocket this is about two inches as well by by one and a half and then of course I just um, for time's sake I already um, adhered this white. whisper white card stock for the pocket and for the skirt and we will be using um, basic gray card stock for the lens or the frame of the lens. We will use um, Whisper White for the eyes. This is actually, uh, I will be telling you what punches I use, but two white and then two of your smoky slate card stock for the lens and I have to use brown for the eyes because Minion's eyes are brown and then of course this is going to be for the skirt and this is just about half inch strips that I cut in half it's it's about eight inches or so and I just cut it in half and we will just put that for the straps of the card or the skirt and then of course you will need another basic black for the headband. So you just use the card again to trace it on the black card stock to create this headband. And then for the punches we will need the one inch circle punch, the one and three eighth circle punch, and the one and three quarter circle punch. 
this acetate sheet for the lens. Before, I used the Sweet Treat cups, but um, this is too big for having two eyes, so I'm just using the acetate today. Um, the French Maid has two eyes instead of just one. So. We will need our dimensionals or pop dots. We will need some buttons. Um, I used the Glimmer Brad before, but I don't really want to bother with brads today, so we'll just use some buttons, whatever. And then for the sentiment of the card, I'm using this Love You to the Moon. I thought this is so perfect for a minion, so um, I've already stamped it on Whisper White against like a black background using our new Banners Framelits die. And I just have this red heart that I have already uh, using the heart embossed lids from Stampin' Up! And I just um, glued it there or adhered it there with a glue dot. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is to get our Daffodil Delight. You will need to trace that rounded edge over there using your plate. And I've already done that um, for the sake of time. And of course, I already cut this um, basic black cardstock and I already adhered this um, Whisper White scallop. So we just need to get our adhesive. All right, so we will need our adhesive. I don't know what's going on here. There you go. to adhere our cardstock. I'm just going to leave just a little bit of the yellow so that um, everyone can see that that's a skirt. So. And then of course for the pocket, I just use my corner rounder to just round the edges over here because this is a pocket. And we will use our dimensional. So we will just adhere that right in the middle. Like so. And then of course we will just need to position the straps like that. So we just need our adhesive again. I have my um, trusty ATG now so we will just use that so we just need to attach the strap over here just so it looks like um, he's wearing a skirt there you go now we have the skirt and the um, the strap and now we will need to do the eyes first. So you need to get your, you will need your one and three quarter circle punch and punch two circles, which I've already done over here. First, we will need our one and three quarter circle punch again and just punch two acetate for the lens. And then the last thing that you need is your black Sharpie, just so we could draw. His mouth. And there you have it. You have your French minion. Isn't he cute? So, 
This is my submission for the Blooms and Butterfly Color Challenge number 22 using Daffodil Delight cardstock, um, Smoky Slate, Basic Gray, Basic Black, and Whisper White. And that is my card for today. Sorry, I forgot to um, tell you guys, maybe it needs some hair, so I just got like um, little strips of black paper like so, and then I just glued that at the back of the card, and then we just need to like maybe cut it. Just a little bit. Just to give the minion <laughs> some hair. So isn't that cute? All right, that's our project for today, our French Minion card. This is my second Minion card now. This one is the normal Minion, and this one is the French Minion. So, isn't, isn't it cute? I hope you make one. And then, of course, for the inside of the card, we can use this as a Valentine card as well. I've already stamped my uh, sentiment over here. It says, love you to the moon and back using our new Love You to the Moon stamp set. This is a very cute stamp set for Valentine's Day. I mean, I love this one it says, thanks for being mine. So I've already um, cut it with the banner framelits and then stamped this and put my little heart there. And I will just put that right in the middle of the card. This sentiment I thought is really perfect for a minion. So there is our minion card, the French minion. So hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you guys later. See you on my next project. Bye for now.